Like listening to a beautiful religious carol during the Christmas season, or for that matter, a Hanukkah selection or Kwanzaa tune. Well, you won't find any of it at this year's winter concerts at either of Bordentown Regional's elementary schools. Joe Sergio, that's first grader Joey in the back seat, says he speaks for lots of parents when he says, We're not happy about it. You know, we're, we're all celebrating holidays together. You know, whether you celebrate Kwanzaa or Hanukkah or Christmas, it's our holiday. And, you know, it's, it's, it's been around forever. It's our tradition. A message on the district homepage from Superintendent Constance Bauer tells parents that questions about some musical selections at elementary winter concerts led to a legal review and a decision that, quote, religious music should not be part of the elementary programs. Most parents we talked to were aware of the message and nearly all had an opinion. Some supported the religious music band. Just to be on the safe side, and could be offending, you know, offensive to other uh, parents, families, because there's just so many different religions out there. Others told us they were fine with even more religious selections, given the time of year. I think the holidays in America is, is a melting pot. I mean, Kwanzaa, Hanukkah, Christmas, let them sing it all. We're a Hindu family and my kids will sing, you know, Merry Christmas and it's, it's a fun holiday for them. I guess if one person gets offended, that's what happens. They want to do away with everything until it chips away and you can't do anything anymore. One parent told us the folks who had questioned the selections had been outed and were the subject of nasty comments from other moms and dads. It's a witch hunt. It's a backlash that I've never seen. I think it's shocking. The district's online message suggests the ban on religious music impacts only the two elementary schools. We wanted a further, clearer explanation of the policy, but my repeated phone calls to Superintendent Bauer's office were not returned. In the newsroom, I'm Bruce Gordon, Fox 29 News.